Today, I would like to focus on the HIV vaccine research and development, which have been conducted by Mahidol University and uh, collaborators, both national and international partners. I am Professor Dr. Pani Piti Sukhitam, have been working in the area of HIV vaccine research and development for over uh, 25 years. The highlight of the work included RV144, which was the largest efficacy trial of HIV vaccine using the planning of our vaccine and boosted with the AIDS recombinant CP 120 vaccine involving 16,402 participants. This study showed only modest efficacy of 31% at three years follow-up. However, when we look at one year uh, follow-up, the efficacy uh, was up to 60%. This showed that there was a waning of the immune response and the booster doses are needed. So we launched another study called the RV306. We have a new set of participants of 360 uh, participants and were divided into various groups and keep boosting at different intervals of 12 months, 15 months, or 18 months. It showed that the longer, the better for the immune responses. At the meantime, we also have established the men having sex with men cohort together with the U.S. Armed Force Research of Medical Science funded by the MHRP and NIH. The incidence in this group was up to 3.7 per 100 person year. The factors determining the high incidence include number of sex partners, which more than five, and also the younger the age group. Now we are launching another study that we call back the participants of the RV306 and provide boosting with a new set of climbing and boosting vaccines. The, the vaccine's combination include the IHV01 invented by the Duke uh, University and the recombinant protein with the RV liposomal adjuvant uh, boost. So now we are enrolling the participant. And I'm proud to inform you that we are being part of the HIV vaccine research program funded by the NIH through the military HIV research program. And we are now planning a new study using a new platform of the mRNA HIV vaccine. Finally, I would like to acknowledge our collaborators and funders, which include Ministry of Public Health, U.S. component of the Armed Force Research of Medical Science, Tulalongkorn University, Chiang Mai University, Military HIV Research Program, and National Institute of Health, U.S. For those who are interested in Looking at the details of the paper, please follow the link. Thank you very much for your attention. Thank you.